Hello and welcome to stage 5 of Let's Play Kyoe's Flying Squadron. This can be one of the most difficult levels in the game because there is a lot of different military things, choppers, toy battleships, rocket launchers, trying to remember what else was in here but uh this level definitely likes to swarm you with a variety of different things that are trying to kill you and it's definitely not a level to be taken too likely because you'll end up dead and these choppers I guess uh since we beat up the Navy they uh, decided to enlist the army for some help because we got these oh what up well that's wonderful we got these uh, I guess they're like tank spiders or something like that they're like tank well they're not really tank walkers because they don't walk around alright so yeah this this level is definitely one of the more difficult ones. Oh great, it's the train. I'm not sure which weapon is better for this level actually. Consensus it likes to swarm you with enemies. Ah, and here we have... I wouldn't call this the mini boss, it's more like... Mm, an annoyance, this flying fortress. It comes back later. Well, a little break time, but we can't take it too easy because we got trains that shoot beams. Oh, let me get my power up. And there's a whole lot of these mechanized menaces. And here we have cannons. Many, many cannons. Shooting many, many cannonballs. Ah, here we go. We're about to see the battalion of the toy ships. These babies. These are the ones that really like to swarm you and here we have it's one of my favorite things the flame throwing tank it's so cool yeah those it's those little ships the way they swarm oh and I think it's coming from the tank too the missiles hmm trying to do as best as I can. This uh, level is pretty difficult. You gotta be on your on your best uh, in your best uh, gameplay to get through this. This looks like so many things are trying to kill you. But it, it makes it fun because it's a real challenge. These... Ah, here we go. Remember the uh, the ship that stole the key? We're almost catching up to it. Oh, I ran into that. Yep, here it is. It's back. But this time, we need to kill it. And that's what I'm going to try to do. Alright. Yes, I do want my heat-seeking bird. Oh, dang nabbit. Uh oh boss music oh and it ran away oh no these things oh no okay okay all is not lost for this boss is a mechanized fortress that is steam powered but I know it's Achilles heel I think if I stay right here or maybe a little bit more up Oh yeah, right here. For this boss, this is all you gotta do. Stay right here and just annihilate it with shots and you will be safe. This right here is what I call the sweet spot. Because you're safe, but the boss is not. So definitely let that boss have it with everything you got. Because, well, a boss like this, I mean, look at all the things that it's firing at you. This is just ridiculous. It's like a rain of bullets all over the place. It's a good thing that they have these little areas where you can just annihilate it. <laughs> and it should be destroyed fairly soon. 
Or maybe not. I don't think my uh, tri-beam is fully powered. Hmm. Perhaps I should use a special attack. Nope, no need. But you see what I mean? Get that spot right there. And that boss is can be the easiest boss of the game. Alright. There's the ship. That 3,000 year old raccoon is in there. And this is the Ark, I guess. Dragon, don't fall asleep, or you will get a bonk on the head. Bonk on the head. Alright. That was the end of stage 5. And I will be uploading stage 6 right after this.